Well, Robbie, we must first start with uh, the name of James Crane. 500 yeah. appearances for the club and uh, a performance from him tonight that he's done over the years, year on year. Yeah, no, fantastic um, occasion for him and his family. It was great, great that uh, we got a win. Uh, it was great that the ground staff and everyone connected to the club got the game on because how we got the game on with the weather we've had is testament to the way we look after the pitch. Certainly, you know, uh, with James and Jack and the, what they do for the pitch, it's um, it's incredible because in and around this area, I don't think of how many games that would be on. So it was great for Craney and it was just a shame he missed the penalty, but it's nice because we can he can talk about the 500, but we can talk about the penalty miss. <laughs> he's forever telling me that he's never missed a penalty. So, no, listen, great, great day for him. Like I said to him, it was important that we wanted to win the game for him and uh, the lads have done that. They could have done it by a lot more than the 3-0 scoreline. Their keeper produced to save after save, Robbie. He did, he did, but you know what I'm like. I'm just a bit like, yeah. is, it, um, is it great keeping or poor finishing? I think it might have been a bit of both. So, But listen, we were creating the chances. And, and one thing I asked today was not a debacle at Little Hampton when you're 3-0 down after about 20 minutes because you don't apply yourself correctly and you don't prepare for the game. And I thought we prefer, prepared for the game in, in the short notice we had in, when I say short notice, it was just the weather conditions. Is the game on? Inspection now, you know, game's on, another inspection. So it was just a little bit, you know, stop start. So I'd like to credit the lads with a good professional that they showed tonight against a good team. And, uh, you know, it's always nice to have a clean sheet and obviously into the next round because, you know, Sussex Senior Cup's one, one competition I'd really like to, you know, have a good running. Like, listen, you'd like a good, good run in any, any, any cup, but certainly this one as well. I have to say, it was a chance for certain players to come in and try and impress you ahead of uh, a busy schedule, Robbie. How did you view the, you know, the Tom Chalets and the other players that came into the side? Done well, you know, it was about getting minutes into some players. Some players needed more minutes, um, an extra minute. You know, I was conscious of Calvin only playing 30 minutes after coming back from an injury. Uh, Harvey obviously had his injury skipper, so we were conscious of them minutes as well. So, listen, like I say, everybody acquitted themselves very well. Everybody can please be pleased with the performance tonight uh, and the application and the attitude they've shown. And, uh, you know, like I said, we will we'll train Thursday with a view to the game on Saturday, which is a, a huge game for us and um, one that we, we've got to go there with confidence and believe we can, we can win. Yeah, if they had their game called off through injuries. I'm sure all those players will be back, though, for Saturday. You can bet your bottom dollar to face us in, uh, you know, there's a rewards now heap up as you make progress in this trophy yeah no absolutely yeah no, you know they've got a few injuries they've got a few injuries tony's got to do the right thing for for his players and, and his club going into saturday it's a big game and you know i fully understand that so you know only we can do is focus on ourselves and from my point of view we needed a few players to have a couple more extra minutes and um and sometimes win and breeze confidence as well so um you know we're pleased with with the 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 evening's work and like I say, we, we'll taper it down a little bit Thursday, ready to obviously full steam ahead on Saturday. Well done. Thanks, Jane. Cheers, Pete. Thanks, Thanks. Thanks.